chopstick here is my one-legged pitho crab that I got from a coworker with the hope of rehabilitating him. I let him settle in for a few days to monitor him and quickly notice that somehow, not only is he more mobile than Toothpick, despite lacking even a single claw, but he can also use his little mouth doodads to pick up food quite effectively. Because his diet is very algae and biofilm based, I decided to add substrate and little pieces of algae with the hope that this would lead him to eat. Soon enough, I saw him picking up grains of sand and sucking off the biofilm, which is a great sign. But I guess his little mouth thingies can't grab the algae off the rock, so he kind of just stares at them. After a bit, I noticed that he wasn't really picking up the sand as much, so I think he cleaned off all the grains of sand in his vicinity, which means now it was time to shove him up a little meal to put in the water. Hopefully he'll be able to grab it. I chose to add some bubble algae and some sea lettuce, as both of these algaes are part of a healthy crab diet. As soon as I added the slurry to the water, he perked right up and started going wacky crazy style. I originally thought that Chopstick would be very difficult to rehabilitate, but so far he seems to be a fully functional crab, minus a couple arms and legs and an eyeball. Now that he's settled in, started eating, and wandering around, it was time to get him comfortable. So I set up a little air supply and put him in another tank that I have in order to keep him nice and warm. He seems to be doing much better than expected, and I'm pretty excited to get to know the little critter. Follow for more updates.